the encouraging news this morning about a second coronavirus vaccine. Wow, a new FDA analysis shows the Moderna vaccine is at least 94% effective and there are no major safety issues. It could be approved for emergency use as soon as Friday. Our lead national correspondent David Begno is at UC Davis Medical Center in Sacramento this morning. David, you had exclusive access as the first shots were given. What are you seeing there? Well, Anthony, they're vaccinating people right now. It's 4 a.m. local time. That's how aggressive they're being. But you know what's happening just next door in an emergency department? They are dealing with what was described to us as a mountain of COVID-19 disease. I mean, the differences could not be more stark. You have the hope happening right here with the vaccine. And in other parts of the state, Central and Southern California, nearly 98% of ICU beds are full this morning. An emergency room doctor here at UC Davis Medical Center in Sacramento recorded this video of the emergency room on his iPhone and he shared it with us to show what was described as a tremendous surge of coronavirus patients. The pandemic has never been worse here. Dr. Nate Cooperman runs the ER here and yesterday I've never been so excited to get an immunization in my life. He was one of the first 300 frontline workers to receive that Pfizer vaccine. With this immunization, I now know that I will not die from this disease. CBS News had exclusive access when 4,875 doses arrived in one box Tuesday morning, three hours ahead of schedule, thanks to the FedEx delivery man who said he was just doing my part. And because of that, the wheels were in motion. As soon as they came off the truck, first stop is the pharmacy to start opening the box. Pharmacy supply chain manager Aaron St. Angelo took the lead. This moment is about to happen. Once the box was open, she immediately placed the vials into this ultra cold freezer. As Aaron's putting it in, it's negative 79 degrees Celsius in the freezer. The next step, take out 100 vials, label them, and give them 30 minutes to thaw out. And then it was time to transport them to the vaccine room using a mobile refrigerator. As they moved through the hospital, one man was pumping his fist in the air. Finally, we're able to give them more or less absolute prevention given the efficacy of this vaccine. Once those first 100 vials, which had 500 doses inside, arrived in the vaccination room, they were allowed to continue thawing out while the call went out to Eva Teniola. She was the nurse who would be the first okay, UC Davis health employee to get the vaccine. I am so super ready. <laughs> As her husband drove her the 18 minutes to the hospital, the vaccine had thawed. It was then mixed with saline solution mm -hmm. and given to Teniola right after she arrived. Yes. That signaled the first of thousands more to come. You can see how excited Eva and her coworkers are. This is the Pfizer vaccine. Moderna's is up next. They could get approval as early as Friday and Gail, they could be giving Moderna's vaccine to frontline workers as early as next week. David, thank you.